Hi friends. Today we have Ms. Kavya, one of my sincere, hardworking and uh, dedicated student. She secured a uh, All India rank 38 in the Indian Forest Service Examination 2021. Her optional subjects are uh, Agriculture and Botany. Actually, it's very difficult to prepare for both these optionals, Agriculture and Botany, in a very short time because we have only two months time between uh, CSE mains and the uh, IFS mains. But she manages to secure very high marks in uh, Agriculture and Botany. So that's why she came uh, topper in, uh, in the Indian Forest Service Examination 2021. So now I welcome uh, Ms. Kavya to share her valuable inputs for the preparation of both agriculture and botany. And she will also tell you uh, how she manages to secure high marks in these optionals. Hello, sir. Uh, first of all, I uh, thank uh, sir for uh, giving this uh, great opportunity to share uh, my experience and uh, things I have learned during this uh, preparation for uh, Indian Forest Service uh, to all of my uh, friends and as friends. Uh, thank you, sir. Okay, Kavya. Uh, now you can proceed uh, with agriculture optional. You can start with your uh, reference books and uh, how you prepare for agriculture optional. Okay. Uh, sir, I am an agriculture graduate. Uh, so it is. it was uh, very uh, relevant for me to take agriculture optional for uh, both uh, uh, civil services and uh, Indian forest services. And uh, as agriculture is my one of my options and botany uh, is uh, very easier for me to manage both things because 60 percentage of the syllabus is covered uh, in agriculture itself. And hence uh, we can uh, allot, allocate uh, on, uh, on full month for a preparation of botany itself. And coming to agriculture, uh, we have a great split up of uh, syllabus. First of all, ecology and environment. And uh, things I have referred is uh, our Shankar IS Academy material given by you. Uh, entirely, I was dependent on that. And there's some add ons uh, from uh, AK Vyas book, uh, Fundamentals. And uh, the next thing is uh, for agronomy. Uh, we also have uh, your uh, material prepared by you that was very much useful and it was very comprehensive. And for agronomy, I have uh, covered the crops from e, e courses, uh, e agri courses from TNEO. Our websites and uh, for uh, weed science and irrigation management i have covered from uh, fundamentals of agronomy by element and uh, graduation and the next thing is uh, uh, soil water conservation and uh, dry land agriculture which is very easier but uh, it is a uh, very much uh, vast syllabus to cover uh, that is uh, covered uh, uh, by the basics was covered from your notes itself so because uh, I have attended the uh, optional classes in Shankar Isaac uh, So the notes was very much helpful for to cover the basics. And the add-ons, uh, I have covered it in Elementor Ready Book. And next thing is agriculture economics and extension, extension which every agriculture option aspirants find it difficult to cover because uh, uh, it is uh, sparsely uh, found in the, in, uh, the books, general book. Uh, but uh, the uh, material you have given was uh, uh, very much handy and also it had many uh, uh, recent examples to cover. I, I believe that uh, the edge of the mark given, uh, I have uh, scored this uh, because of the uh, relevance in the current events and uh, case studies given by you. And the uh, next thing is uh, far, the farm management extension, everything I have covered in that itself. And uh, coming to the forestry in uh, uh, paper one of agriculture syllabus also, I have covered it from your uh, uh, notes and materials and uh, it was uh, uh, very uh, uh, relevant to the current things like uh, case studies for agro for, from agroforestry, mm -hmm. social forestry, uh, everything uh, like uh, tribal movements in Odisha, Jark and we have given much, uh, much of the case studies during the classes itself. So I think that I can uh, relate it with the uh, questions asked from there. And in case of uh, paper two, uh, the cell biology and genetics, I have covered it from uh, Kundan Singh book. And breeding is also covered in a uh, plant breeding book by uh, Kundan Singh. And uh, next is uh, sea technology and entomology and pathology. I did not uh, find a uh, very comprehensive book there, but I was uh, entirely dependent on the uh, material given by you and, and the handouts from our academy. Uh, so I could uh, uh, cover the entire syllabus uh, in a way that no question other than the material was asked in the previous years. I can, uh, I can, I cannot see anything uh, apart from the material that was asked in the previous years. 
that is one of the uh, key to cover the all the syllabus in the paper which is very much hard to cover actually and the next thing is uh, food security and nutrition this is also very much vast syllabus uh, but it is uh, easier when it is covered in a, a very targeted way and uh, the things you have uh, told us uh, taught us in the class and also notes given by you are very much helpful and the thing that has a uh, uh, health mean food security nutrition uh, syllabus is that you have given us uh, uh, case studies and uh, uh, quoted some ministries uh, data also in during the class itself that was also very much uh, helpful for me and the uh, next thing is horticulture i have covered from n kumar book and the crops uh, also covered in e courses survey online from tna websites okay so tell, tell about your answer writing practice Uh, sir, uh, I have been associated with our academy and the optional uh, from 2018-19 preparation. Sir, I have uh, I didn't hear in the 2019 and 2020 prelims, but I uh, took it as an advantage to cover my optionals in those three months because I cannot sit idle for the three months. But and it was it was also very difficult for me to go back and read GS because it gives me the memory of uh, failing the prelims uh, of 2019-2020. so i took that opportunity to cover all of my optional itself uh, in a way that i have covered the standard book uh, from uh, front cover to back cover everything i have covered that time so because covering optional is easier in a way that it is static and it does not change like the gs uh, so that is one of my uh, practice that time itself i have uh, applied for our mains coming and in the optional so i have been associated for all the three years uh, and i have applied for optional and i could uh, see a clear change in my clear change in rise in my marks from 2019 2021 optional mains topic because i have uh, written uh, uh, the same syllabus but in different ways and the questions you have asked are also did not repeat any time uh, for the three years so it was easier for me to cover the peripheral topics also that gave me much of confidence so the answer writing practice uh, uh, was uh, from your guidance and you have also given us a model answer uh, every for every test so that helped me to have add ons for the main examination uh, we used to take uh, print outs from that and we used to have uh, notes from your model answers uh, so that i could uh, cover the peripheral topics and uh, uh, case studies example uh, i think that has given me the edge in agriculture optionals okay thank you so uh, tell about your the botany preparation how you manages within the one and a half two months time between uh, csc mains and uh, ifs mains uh, sir this time uh, we had only 41 days of uh, gap between uh, csc and ifs mains and also i needed a seven days or or five to seven days of uh, rest and rejuvenation for me to recoup uh, to study this ifs mains uh, so uh, first i have uh, Uh, completed all of my uh, agri optional revision in ten days, and I have taken uh, this uh, GK and uh, uh, general English uh, each of uh, three three days, so that I could cover. Uh, uh, I could have only fifteen uh, days of time for uh, uh, botany, fifteen to twenty days for botany. In that also, in fifteen uh, to twenty days, I have allocated uh, some twelve to fifteen days for uh, first paper botany preparation itself. Because uh, the in the second paper, sixty percent is covered uh, in agriculture itself, as I said uh, before. Uh, so I could uh, balance uh, my uh, revision of agriculture optional with the new newly studying of botany optional in that time itself. Uh, that is, there is uh, not much difference between them because there are some add-ons uh, to study in botany optional uh, that can be uh, uh, related with the agri optional preparation itself. Uh, like the prior hypothesis uh, multi gene concepts which are new uh, in botany which is not found in agriculture but it is not an issue because uh, when we are studying the cell genetics uh, on evolution condensing we can cover this also this add ons also yeah. can be covered uh, so that was the uh, that was uh, the period of uh, preparation of botany and uh, we had a 2 to 3 days uh, botany revision uh, we had a 4 days of uh, gap between the gk gs and uh, uh english and the uh, optional uh, so those four days i have used for uh, revision uh, the thing of uh, thing we have prepared botany is that uh, the group discussion mm -hmm. which was very yeah. much helpful uh, we were a group of uh, four people with agri botany optionals and uh, all of us are your students uh, and i am glad to say that here also 
and uh, we had a very good uh, uh, separation of uh, topics and syllabus uh, for example in angel sums we have 20 families which is very much impossible to cover by a single person but we have divided as uh, with a uh, five uh, families each and we have uh, studied the relevant uh, and the important concepts itself from them uh, so that was the strategy we have done in botany preparation the group discussion was very much helpful too and in case of uh, paper 1 uh, starting from microbiology uh, till that uh, plant resource development in first paper everything was our hand written notes okay. because everything was new to us it is not covered yes. in agriculture uh, so even the topics of reproduction fungi or virus or about uh, even the small topics like bacteria fast and uh, fungal toxins everything was our uh, own notes from uh, we have taken cues from senior notes and from uh, multiple institutes notes and uh, we have also watched many youtube channels like rna synthesis dna how it is uh, evolving uh, prion hypothesis these are these are found in our agriculture optional uh, so from youtube uh, channels we have uh, taken notes and cues and we have uh, prepared handwritten notes by ourselves we have exchanged us uh, with uh, between us and we have uh, read about it sir okay right sir so can you tell us some uh, sources for botany preparation sure, sir. Oh. Uh, so starting from microbiology and plant uh, pathology we have a uh, most uh, uh, hand written only but we didn't have any uh, standard books for that because we had a uh, only uh, 15 to 20 days time for it and for uh, cryptograms and phanerograms we have allocated uh, the topics in syllabus wise and that was also taken uh, notes from the uh, website itself and uh, uh, from for angel sperms like stomata and uh, uh, cycles and uh, other uh, embryology we had uh, uh, references from our 11th and 12th tamil nadu scrt books okay Good. and also uh, the cycles were, uh, cycles were also we have to cover and uh, the next is a family uh, we have 20 families which is, uh, so, so many families are already covered in our old tamil nadu book uh, botany uh, bio- biology books and uh, scrt new and scrt books also. and uh, for plant utility and exploit uh, expectation we had a uh, senior notes uh, mm. uh, so and also we have browsed uh, for uh, from many uh, sources so the thing we have followed is uh, uh, we had uh, the previous uh, questions are only revised yes. mm. uh, first we had 2 to 3 days to study the previous uh, questions sir uh, from that questions we had uh, uh, we had an idea what to study how much to study mm. what to avoid so we had a boundary uh, for us Uh, up, up to about uh, which we can cover and the peripheral topics we uh, left it actually because we didn't have much mm. time to cover that so by that way we have uh, covered the entire botany syllabus itself and uh, for uh, uh, morphology also we had a uh, uh, syllabus wise uh, uh, topics and uh, we had a uh, uh, notes from the internet itself okay okay right and uh, for uh, paper 2 Uh, as i have already said for cell biology breeding uh, and uh, genetics everything uh, is from our agriculture syllabus itself we have covered from kundan singh books and uh, we had used uh, plant uh, for plant physiology we can join books it was very much comprehensive mm. every topic can be found yes in. and some add ons were not found in that uh, like uh, fruit ripening these and all we have covered from our university uh, notes itself we were doing also we had some tna Uh, so that everything was very uh, uh, very uh, uh, crux and uh, we had uh, what is what the definition the types the diagram and uh, we found this is uh, sufficient to have a good scores so we had uh, uh, less time allocation for uh, uh, reading them and the next thing is uh, for uh, uh, biochemistry which is not found in our agriculture optional we had from our e agri courses uh, biochemistry and from syllabus wise uh, we can we uh, took notes from that everything was hand written notes okay so okay. we could uh, revise it at the last minute and the next thing is ecology and plant uh, geography uh, we had covered entirely from uh, shankar is academy and from the like succession yeah. everything we have covered from that <coughs> i thought that uh, this, this is very much comprehensive and mm-hmm. some add ons like examples we had taken from what we have studied in gs so there was much of a ground work rather than studying and uh, Uh, repeatedly studying some books um, or some materials okay, okay. so the, for a, from a, for a period of uh, 40 days in which we had to allocate only uh, rarely two to three weeks we had a groundwork uh, for this week good right. any final words for our students uh, 
sir i have to convey that uh, many people are uh, very much afraid of taking uh, agriculture optional uh, agriculture is optional and uh, the thing i have to convey is it is very much easier when we have a groundwork for that when we have a very much interest in nature and agriculture it is very easier for even a non agriculture background students uh, to take this Uh, we are, I also have many friends who have taken agriculture, but they are non-optional, non-agriculture uh, background, and they have also taken botany as an optional because they have a strong ground in agriculture. Uh, so, uh, who are uh, uh, sincerely preparing or uh, aspiring for Indian Forest Services can definitely uh, take this combination because uh, others have will have a uh, geology and forestry as their options. Both will be very new to them. So forty yes. days will not be enough for them to cover both the things. But when we have agriculture as an optional for civil services and uh, botany for for uh, uh, botany and agriculture for Indian forest services, it will be very much easier for them to cover. That gives the satisfaction, the satisfaction, and also very much of confidence to go on attempt yes. the examination. Uh, we can uh, definitely have a, a flying colors from these combinations. Uh, so I have to convey this. And the next thing is. Uh, Uh, I have to convey a uh, lot of groundwork we should uh, have, like uh, watching videos, like uh, YouTube videos. For we had uh, like prayer hypothesis, everything uh, we did not know how to study. So we had uh, the help of uh, YouTube and other uh, uh, websites from that we browse and uh, take most most from that. And the next thing is, uh, uh, if you have uh, uh, the chance and opportunity, go for a group discussion. Oh, yeah. That will be very much helpful <coughs> and efficient. uh the the benefit cost ratio is very much high from that uh, we can have sharing of knowledge and and also doubts can be clarified with that uh, we should have a very very good uh, uh, rapport with uh, both our uh, syllabus and also our mind to have a uh, go for a very uh, good uh, answer okay, good, good. Right. okay thank you gavya thank you very much for your valuable time okay so friends uh, i hope this video was very useful for you right thank you